Hey guys, it's Jay Span. I just wanted to shoot a quick video. I have deleted my fan page tab because the spelling would not update. So I'm gonna create a new iframes app and show you how easy it is to integrate a WordPress site or an HTML site inside your fan page. Um, you can see here the fan page I created with headway themes. It's just a WordPress site and I created it in 520 pixels width. Um, some of the different pages, contact form. So what we'll need to do is go into the developers. We want to set up a new to app, app name. I'm going to call it QSM uh, fan page. Agree to the terms, create the app. Really? Hate captures. At least I can tell what that one is. Okay, so QSM fan page, quick description. Link to my WordPress site. Update icon. I'll just probably put the same icon in there. I'll just put this favicon. Upload that in there. I'll probably put that in. Nah, I might do a different logo. Um, let's see if I've got something. This will work. So I've uploaded a couple PNGs there. So email. Um, that's fine. Privacy policy. That'll auto populate. There we go. I didn't want to have to look that up again. So we'll save the changes there. Website, the site URL, that's the site I'm linking to. So my marketingeffect.com. You correct that. I always want to try and have www in there. It just makes it a lot easier. Okay, the canvas page. So we leave that. The canvas URL is marketingeffect.com again. So we go down to canvas type. Obviously we want iframes. We don't want scroll bars, which only affects certain browsers anyway. Social discovery enabled tab name. Let's try and get this one right this time. Index.php. Um, it's index.php because I'm using a WordPress site. If you use, if you were using a Dreamweaver site or just static HTML, that would be index.html, obviously. And that is it, guys. Save changes. Okay guys, so you go to the application profile page, add to my page. You want to add it to your main page, close. So we'll go back to QuickSpark Media, we'll refresh that. So there's our app. 